in click in click inside this box then only it will be appearing okay so uh, after this the first is view type in this view type you can change your view name and all those things uh, view name and uh, geometry references if you want any references you can take it from here will not be using that much if you want to rotate it at some angle you can simply click and uh, go with some rotation angles over here okay okay then here uh, most of the times you'll be going with isometric the view you want whether you want it to be front back bottom or what type of view you want you can simply click so uh, first thing i'll be going with a front view okay after that the next thing I'll, i will be going with this scale i'll just go to custom scale i still don't know why it is giving me inches uh, this is this should not happen okay just a minute drawing properties it is giving me an in inches i don't want that to be an in inches see it is giving me the scale value in inches i want to change that in uh, uh mm how can i change it so this giving it should not give it uh, because i have selected my default uh, units as mm it should give me in mm only but it is giving me in uh and just okay fine uh, i'll see the scale and i'll let you know how to change it tomorrow uh, but still it is uh, it should give me in mm okay the next option okay the next option uh, would go with is alignment No, 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 origin. Still my best. Good thing is fine. units sign i want the units where they can get the units here now i hope it should give me uh, let me try once oh uh, now it is giving me in units no 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 zero point it should be at least 
Mm -hmm. guys. Uh, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me. Okay. Uh, uh, where, 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 where? Actually, this is this is decimal, but it's not allowing it allowing me to change the value. Uh, what should I type here? So guys, uh, so this is, uh, I, I just wanted to show you if you want to change anything and you're not able to find that option, simply go to the page properties or model properties, click on change here, whatever uh, you want to find it, just type it. So I'm, uh, once again, I'll look into that. Uh, general, click on okay. In that, I want scale. Okay, I have given it mm, but uh, custom scale it is still giving me value in inches. Value in inches. So that's what I do. I don't want that. Before that, I would check my right. Uh, whether this is in inches or not first i have to know that see why because the paper the paper size i have selected is a3 uh, so it will be around 297 by 420 mm if you are speaking in mm if this if this is in inches so whatever i am doing there it is wrong okay i'll, I'll explain you if whatever the values you have 390 what uh, 349.7 124 are if they are in inches okay then uh, whatever i did in drafting was right okay first let me check uh, this particular uh, sketch whether it is in inches or whether it is in what do you call mm or not so how will you check anyone any idea Simply open this file. Okay, I have no access to prepare. Okay, okay, okay. Let us see. Now I shall have prepare model properties. It is in inches. That means technically what I was doing, I was trying to keep uh, 394 or 392 somewhat inches into 420 mm. So that is why it is showing me 0 0.01. I was thinking that 0 0.01 was in inches so that the scale is getting down. So I uh, have done a, a mistake there. So always when you are stuck in these type of situations, it's better to check your units. Okay. So I need <clears throat> come here, click on MMNS. Set 
I want one inch to become one mm so that okay three forty five or three twenty five whatever inches will become three forty five mm okay now save it once you have saved go back to drawing okay now go to general view in general view i'll go with no combination uh, no combined state click on okay click on it now let us see whether custom scale it's still 0 0.1 ah. yeah. Oof. we'll go with 0 0.5 apply no it is not yet changed yet not changed so for the these things you need to uh, tackle it very carefully so once again i'll come here path file prepare model properties it is in inches change obviously i want to change it this one whatever uh, set convert one to 25.4 or one inches to one m so this is what i want Converted it. Close. 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 Then I'll go with Control S. Okay. Again, I'll go to drawing. Scale. I want it to be 0 0.5 mm here. Okay, sheet properties. Once again, I'll be checking. Right click, sheet sheet setup A two. It is not also A three. It is A two, which is five ninety four by four twenty mm. Okay, okay. So let's go now. Go to general view. No combine. Click on okay. Somewhere, 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 somewhere. I'm deflecting. I don't know where I'm getting it from. Sheet scale. Sheet. Okay, what I'll do, I'll just close this particular drawing. I'll start it from the beginning. File, new, uncheck, drawing, click on OK. I was towards empty sheets, A2. Generate all common command set click on to it go to scale go. still in the same scale if i'm going to 0 0.5 also it is making it too much big yes you are understanding the problem here right
Yes, uh, what we'll do? Uh, we'll stop the class here tomorrow. I'll I'll see uh, how it is going. I don't know where I got stuck. I, I got stuck between the conversions. Uh, I don't know exactly where I'm getting it wrong. Suppose okay. Once again, I'll check it here. Uh, that. Uh oh, this should not happen. Actually, I asked him to do one centimeter. Uh, the one inch is equal to one mm. So this guy converted. So this should not happen. So ah, uh, ready hell. Now everything I need to change. See, this is what happens when you do not give attention to your units. <laughs> I'll just go with it. Extrude chamfer, edit. Oh, oh, not this much I want. I'll reduce the extrude, edit. Extrude, I want it to be. 250 as well so that it is a square okay chamfer edit can delete it again go with the new set chamfer value i'll be giving it to be 25 or let us say 30 50 done again go with Okay, a draft, 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 draft is much more. Okay. Done, draft. Where is the hole? Hole is in the air. Okay, save it. I think it should not create any disturbances as of now. Okay, now we'll go with drafting. I want to close the old drafting. I don't, excuse me guys. So this is what happens if you are not cautious with your uh, Uh, units so to just um, diagnose it itself it took me around about 15 or half an hour of my time file new 
I knew I'll be going with drawing. In drawing, I don't want the default template. Click on OK. I'll be, go I'll be going with empty sheets. A2, you can adjust the sheet properties over here. OK, now. Now, you can go with. Uh, OK, if you want to add a new sheet, simply click on new sheet automatically your uh, sheet will will be added if you want the first sheet you can come here you can see the, see my arrow over here you can come here you can click onto this and if you want the second sheet you can go and click onto this you click onto this whether you want to update it rename again new sheet move or copy delete or select all you can or you can go with even setup okay the scale of this is now it is exactly one one now we will check how our uh, uh, objects are coming so no command state click on okay and simply now exactly it came see now we can change it however you want this is what i wanted to do okay because see my uh, part was in inches and the inches was 300 to 400 somewhere and my page size is just 450 mm okay the page i took is a2 which is 598 by 420 mm and my part size was around 390 or 350 inches so there is a huge difference that is why we are not able to even the scale it was showing 0.001 so if if I give one also it 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 will be not an issue for me. Okay, it is easy. Suppose if you have to change the individual, uh, this this is the total page value. See you can see the scale here. Double click. If you want to change it, you can change it from here. That means whatever uh, the uh, scale is there, whatever the objects or whatever the views you have created in this drawing, it will all will change to one. Double click on if you want to change individual view here. Right click, sorry, not right click. Right click, go to properties, in properties, go to scale, and you can change it 0 0.25. Click on OK, it will be changing back suppose if you want to change any view properties okay you can right click go to view properties and okay fine now we'll see so if you want to change the view now as of now it is in isometric i you don't want isometric but instead you want the front view click on okay automatically it will be changing into front view okay Next again, right click, go to properties. Okay. If you want to change the views, you can come here and you can easily change it. Next is orientation. Uh, if you want to change it, suppose I want to change it seven and I want to move it uh, to uh, say two. Apply. See, it is moving. If you change uh, the orientation or view location, the view of the location in the sheet, sheet, you can change it from here. Or simply, you can click on it. You can use this option, unlock view movement. Then you can drag it wherever you want. There is no need for you to go right click, go to properties, go to ori origin and from here you can change for example see i'll give five by five it will come to five by five remember those are in inches if you want to change that you can right click uh, no 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 oh, how we can change it okay file repair drawing properties go to detail view and uh, search for units here. I did not find units, UNITS units. 
in units click on mm add on change close apply and close now right click remember right click you cannot uh, just simply click on it and leave you need to hold it for one to one or two seconds then only it will it will show you that right it will show you that pop up window otherwise it will not show you go to properties origin now you are getting in mm okay now you understood how to change right how to change mm m uh, inches to mm okay newspaper uh make uh, minute just a minute eh? i'll i'll be back in two minutes uh Ever, one minute, one minute. Auto mute it. okay um so basically uh, uh aligned to other view it is an uh, entirely a different option okay guys uh, what we'll do uh, we'll continue this class and uh, tomorrow section i thought today i'll complete it but because of that uh, uh, units mismatch i got confused okay tomorrow uh, we'll continue the same class and the day after tomorrow we'll go with the same okay uh, tomorrow uh, most probably most probably uh, we'll start the class at 8 30. I'll, I'll give the timings if i'm not mentioning any timings by uh, today evening the same as usual nine o'clock if i'm mentioning any timings then we will start the class at that time okay okay guys uh, i'll end the call here i'll see you in tomorrow's class okay bye guys Guys, try to do that assembly assignment. Okay. Uh, if a management asks, I, I need to show that you have submitted it. So try to do it. If you're having any doubt, okay. we can clear it in the class. Okay. Okay, guys, then. Uh, bye. See you tomorrow then. So, thank you.